Hi all, today's topic is Gauss Divergence Theorem. Double integral over f into n vector into ds equal to triple integral over dive into f vector into dv. For a problem 3, it is not asked for a verify, it is asked for to evaluate only. So Gauss Divergence Theorem, some costing is given, double integral over over the surface of the cube bounded by the coordinate plane and uh, plane x equal to y equal to and z equal to 0. Coordinate plane means uh, 0, 0. That is 0, 0, 0. So all 0, lower limit 0, upper limit A. All the parameter it is with respect to A. So limit it is given. So the question it is asked to evaluate only it is asked. So how to evaluate means in the question itself is given to be evaluate means See here now it is in the format double integral over the question is some f1 into d by dx plus f2 into d z dx and f3 into dx dy it is a question given this is question this is the question format given now we have to evaluate only it's asked so now we will do it by this right hand side part so it's easy for my calculation all the three integration are given in the question so so now costing first f1 I will write it from the costing. So f1 is nothing but x cube minus y z f2 something but minus 2 x squared y f3 when I write it z. Okay. So f1 with respect to x do f1 by x. So when I differentiate it, so 3 x squared only. So, do f2 by y. So, y when I differentiate it, minus 2 x squared. Do f3 with respect to z when I differentiate it, it's 1. So, so now our question, so add all the 3. So, it's nothing but do f1 by do x1 plus do f2 by do y plus do f3. By do is that to add everything 3x squared minus 2x squared plus 1. So when I add it, it's nothing but x squared plus 1. So now our question is x squared plus 1. So triple integration over x squared plus 1 into dv. dv is nothing but according to the limit whatever we write. All the limits are 0 to a. It's no problem whatever we write it. So, it's nothing but I will write dz, dy and dx. It's not wrong. dx, dy, dz we write it because all the limits are same. So, it's different also. We should be very careful when we write it. So, 0 to a. So, now I will integrate it with respect to first with respect to z. So, z when I differentiate x squared z plus z 0 to a dy dx. So, substitute a will be substituted, a can be taken outside so that it will take it outside 0 to a uh, 0 to a so x squared plus 1 into dy dx again with respect to y i have to integrate it y when i integrate it so a 0 to a so y term is not there so when i integrate it x square plus 1 i will keep it as constant y is not there so y is a 0 to a dx okay so again a is taken outside so a squared 0 to a x squared plus 1 into dx. Okay, again one more time when I integrate it. So x cube by 3 plus x into 0 to a substitute a. So again when I substitute a, a squared again a cube by 3 plus a. One a I will take it outside. So when I take it outside a cube into a squared by 3 plus 1 is my answer. So, what is my answer? a cube into a squared by 3 plus 1 is my Thank you.